Yeah. Hey guys, so I guess there's only one little benefit you get from this video. You can either get peace tea, because I'm a peace tea and I have tons of it, or a red velvet cupcake. I mean, not everybody likes red velvet, but I do. And as you can see, my parents like red velvet because they ate so many of them. Music. Okay, so this video today will be kind of like a story time slash explaining my hair slash telling you how it happened or how this this shit happened. Okay, where to start? I was watching this movie, and as you can see, Anne Hathaway has bangs here, right? Well, I told my mom, like, Mom, Anne Hathaway has bangs. I want bangs. She looks so beautiful with bangs. Maybe I'll look good with bangs. And so she's just like, are you sure about this? I'm like, yeah, I'm sure. I was like, but mom, there's one little problem. So whenever I get anxious, I cut hair. It's just a whole problem with anxiety. I don't know how to handle it. So when I was younger, or this happened recently in like eighth grade, I started cutting my hair. So I had hair like right here that I'd cut really short, just like right there. Or like this huge clump of hair I'd like right here. Not that much I'd cut, really short, just because I was really stressed out and stuff. So, and she was like, oh, that's fine, that'll be fine, that won't cause a problem with bangs. So we parted my hair down the middle, and she took, like, this much hair, and she just flat out cut it, and she went, and I started crying. I was like, oh no, what did I do? Because this was, like, down to here. was like long and I started freaking out and I was like no mom my hair's ruined I'm ruined I look bad I look ugly and I started bawling like my mom even got a picture of me bawling she's like this is what you look like after that I started freaking out and I'm like okay you know what I'm just gonna do them as side bangs so I like started parting I started doing this whole smooth thing with my hair which is why it started doing this. But at this point, it was just like I had moved most of the shorter part over to this side. And I had some of it over here. So I pretty much looked something like this, except for I had no layers in my hair at this time. I didn't die here whatsoever. My hair was one length, one solid length, and it was thick, and I hated it. And so, like, over time, it started growing out and growing out, and I, it just, I started doing this with my hair, I'm like, ooh, what happens if I, like, move this stuff around? And my hair kind of just started naturally doing this after a while, just this whole super effect, even though I kind of messed up my hair. Oh, well. But it started getting, like, this natural swoop. And I was like, um... I don't know what my hair's doing, but it looks cute and I like it and it works well with my face shape. It's very hard to find a, a haircut that goes with my face shape that I'm okay with. I, I like to like decide what hair types go with people. And after a while I just started trimming my hair and I started adding layers to it because I got tired of how thick it was. Like I was like, okay, I'm done with having thick hair, it's summer, I'm done with this. So I ended up going like this, and I was like, like, took scissors and just, and at one point I was just like, you know what would work better at thinning my hair? A razor blade, so I ended up buying a crop and a razor blade, so just, and that worked really well, but my mom recently, she bought me professional hair cutting scissors, because I cut my brother's hair now, and mine. They're really freaking sharp, like, holy crap, and pretty much all I do is... Like I take this hair and I move it, and so I take this and then I'm like, okay, and then I'm like, I'm not actually cutting my hair right now, even though I did get a couple hairs off. And then with this part, I go, I kind of just swoop my hair over, and I just go like, I cut it at an angle, that's all you really can do. And then for this, this is the harder part for me, because you have to cut this part longer than this part, so I pretty much just go like, I cut these hairs shorter, and I cut the other ones. I'm not very good at explaining how I cut hair. Just 
should not trust him in scissors because my hair was like this long and it was nice and I loved it. But I just kind of got anxiety and just went cut hair, cut hair. Because that's all I do when I'm anxious is cut my hair because I'm like, oh, that'll make me feel better. No. It makes me feel worse in the end. Because I'm like, oh no, my beautiful hair. <laughs> so yeah, that was pretty much how this happened. It was not per on purpose, but I I hope you liked this really lame video. Now y'all get cupcakes and paste tea. Uh, yeah, bye.